See now the wires uh, which are we know that in at our homes the wires are coming from the poles. So what happened? The wire from the poles they come to the uh, they are attached to the like when the wires from the poles are reaching home they are connected to an energy meter, and that energy meter is a, or you can say that device is called as kilowatt meter. That is called as kilowatt meter. So wire from pole. Is uh, coming to a kilowatt meter. That is, it is connected to a device called kilowatt meter, and from where it is, the connections are ma uh, made with the main switch and main fuse on distribution board. And from here, from here, uh, it is being supplied or it is being connected to the different parts. Uh, or different appliances which are worked at the, uh, which are working in the home, or different connections which are made. So the commercial unit of the electric energy in which we measure uh, energy is kilowatt hour. What is it? It is kilowatt hour. Now, what does it mean? It means that the amount of energy consumed when the appliance of one kilowatt works for one hour. So obviously, kilowatt is the power of the appliance, and R is the time. So we say that electric energy, or the amount of energy which is consumed when appliance of one kilowatt works for one hour. So the, in this unit, we are going to calculate the electric energy, or the bill which you get at home is the, is in the form of units, and each unit is equal to kilowatt hour. So here, I'm just going to take a few questions, and before I take up questions, I want to tell you that one kilowatt hour. Is equal to how many joules? We know that the energy of uh, unit of energy is also joule, so it comes out to be 3.6 into 10 raised to power 6 joules. How? See, it is 1 kilowatt hour, right? So it means uh, this thing 1000 watt into 60 into 60, if we convert into seconds, right? So this is uh, we can write 1000 joule per second. And it is into 60 into 60. So when you will solve it, it will come out to be 3.6 into 10 raised to power 6 joule. So if you have uh, kilowatts, uh, kilowatt hour and you need to convert into joule, just multiply with this figure or vice versa, you can do that. So that means there is a conversion unit. That means you can convert kilowatt hour into joule because 1 kilowatt hour is equal to 3.6 into 10 raised to power 6 joule. And moreover, you should know that 1 kilowatt hour also means 1 unit. 1 kilowatt hour also means 1 unit. So now it is time to take up question based on it. So see, we have an electric heater which is rated at 1500 watt. So that means power is 1500 watt. What would be the electric energy consumed? We need to find energy when it is used for 2 hours. <coughs> so time is 2 hours. So now we know that electric energy is equal to power into time. This is the formula for electric energy. So whenever we, you need to calculate electric energy, you need to calculate by P into T. And suppose if I say one fan, it becomes one into P into T. But if I say three fans, we use the term N also. N means three fans. The, and N refers to number of appellants of same kind. Number of appellants of same kind. So I will write here n, try to remember always n whether it is 1 or 2, so just try to uh, uh, remember in the formula. So it is E, it is 1 heater, so 1, power is 1500 and time is 2 hours. So it comes out to be 3000, it was in watt and time was in hour, watt hour, but our commercial unit is kilowatt hour. So that means if we need to convert into kilowatt, how? By dividing with 1000. When we divide with 1000, it comes out to be 3 kilowatt hour. So this is the answer. I think you got it. First I calculate electric energy because the power was in watt. So I just divide by 1000 and after dividing it came in the SI unit that is the 3 kilowatt hour. That is the commercial unit of electric energy. We will also say that this is the commercial unit. One more question, a bulb rated at 100 watt, there is a bulb whose power is 100 watt, there is an iron of 750 watt, there is iron power 750 watt, there is a TV of 100 watt, so we have so many appliances. They all are used 
थ्री आवर्स अ डे दैट मीन्स इट इज ऑल्सो यूज फॉर थ्री आवर्स दिस इज ऑल्सो यूज फॉर थ्री आवर्स दिस इज ऑल्सो यूज फॉर थ्री आवर्स वी नीड टू फाइंड द एनर्जी कंज्यूम्ड इन द मंथ ऑफ थर्टी डेज सो फर्स्ट विल बी टेकिंग आउट द एनर्जी ऑफ वन डे सो इफ यू टेक आउट द एनर्जी ऑफ द बल्ब इट कम्स आउट टू बी वन बल्ब पावर इज हंड्रेड टाइम इज थ्री comes out to be 300 but we need in this is watt hour we need in kilowatt dividing with 1000 it comes out to be 0.3 kilowatt hour same for iron it is e is equal to 1 iron of 750 into 3 hours so it comes out to be 2250 watt hour but when we convert into kilowatt hour it becomes 2.25 kilowatt hour third is for the tv it is e is equal to again in pt one tv power is 100 used for 3 hours 300 watt hour converting into kilowatt 0.3 kilowatt hour so this is the energy consumed by bulb this and this in one day so if if we ask that uh, the total amount of energy consumed in one day we'll be adding all three so it is 0.3 plus 0.3 plus 2.25 so it comes out to be 5 2.85 kilowatt hour is the energy consumed in one day and you have been asked for 30 days so this is one day energy so for 30 days you will be multiplying with 